I've had the look at the new World Drone website and I think it's a really good change. Uh, we mostly use it for looking at the race results and athlete profiles, which is really good. I've had a look at it today to find out the results. It's clear, easy to navigate so far. Um, good, good start. I like the athlete of the month thing. It's really interesting to find, find out about individuals. Because then you see, you, you know, you walk past them and see them and go, oh yeah, I know about you, I'll say hello. It's an honour for me, even if I don't think I really totally deserve it. It's always interesting for other athletes to show how, how other, other rowers do and yeah, what they think about racing and so on. Yeah, it's always funny and interesting. It's great. Uh, many people are talking to me. Uh, also here in Belgrade, uh, some people are recognizing me and it feels great, uh, great. and I also feel that I must uh, work on to deserve it. <laughs> there's never enough photos. I don't think there's ever enough. Everyone loves seeing themselves, like all their crew out there on the water and stuff, so I think you could never have enough photos. Funny enough, I used the website yesterday for the first time and one of the things was actually to see some of the profile pictures of some of my fellow squad members because obviously some of the guys have been around for a really long time so there's a lot more hair on their heads back then than there are now. It was funny because Hodgie looked at his picture yesterday and he realised how good his hair was. Um, so today we almost missed the bus because he was blow drying his hair. It's, a, it's an incredibly important resource. Um, you know, which athletes are out there, you know, finding out, bringing them the sport to life. Um, people on the bank, you know, boats, people in boats become quite anonymous unless you can really pick out those individuals, learn more about them, find out their flair, find out what they're all about. And the website plays a huge part in that. It's, uh, it's a mix, it's, it's got everything that you want in the world of rowing. It's something that I tweet out. So if there's no video coverage of the uh, regatta, which there normally isn't on the fr Thursday, Friday, Saturday until the finals, so they have the live race tracker and that still gets people excited. All my family at home, when it's not televised on, you know, at, back at home, everyone watches it, watches the live feed. It's really important. It's actually really important for me and my family, all of us really, to have that facility available.